The Adverse Childhood Experiences Study in Trauma-Informed Care can be traced to Dr. Vincent Folletti in a failing obesity clinic in Southern California. The chief of Kaiser Permanente's Department of Preventative Medicine, Folletti, was stumped. Here he was, trying to reduce health care costs, and half of the people who entered his obesity clinic ended up dropping out. He sought out those people and had one-on-one discussions with them, asking questions like, what was your birth weight? What about when you entered school, when you got married, etc.? Then came a tragic breakthrough. Tragic because Folletti asked a woman how much she weighed when she was first sexually active. Her tearful answer, 40 pounds. She'd been the victim of incest at the age of four. Dr. Folletti then heard similar stories of abuse from other obesity clinic dropouts. Weight gain in these cases was anxiety decreasing, a coping practice. Freddie and a squad of researchers fanned out, studying nearly 20,000 people, proving that individuals who experienced trauma when they were children were far more likely to have what doctors call maladaptive behaviors that led to depression, suicide attempts, cancer, liver disease, heart disease, derailed lives, and premature death. From the study, a simple ACEs, Adverse Childhood Experiences test was created. Ten questions, the answers of which can offer a window into what's really going on with, say, a student and guide the trauma-informed care, which can help them build healthy resilience.